Certain criteria needs to be met for the parking aid system to function correctly. Please be aware that the system may not function in all road and weather conditions. The parking aid sensors located in the front and rear bumpers and on each corner of the vehicle need to be kept clean and clear of any ice, frost, dirt or anything obstructing its detection pathway. Please be aware that sensors may not detect moving objects such as children or animals until they are dangerously close, some overhanging objects or barriers or thin obstructions. When driving slowly forwards into a parking space, with drive selected, press the parking aid button in the overhead console to activate the system. The front and side sensors activate and the indicator in the parking aid button illuminates to confirm selection. The touchscreen displays an overhead view of the vehicle and the surrounding area. The vehicle's predicted pathway, based on the position of the steering wheel and the vehicle's speed, is shown on the display. Any obstacles within the vehicle's surroundings are displayed as coloured blocks on the touchscreen. These coloured blocks depict the likelihood of a collision with the detected obstacle and the risk level. When an object is detected, a warning tone is also emitted. This increases in frequency as you move closer to the object and becomes constant when the object is within 30 centimeters of the bumper. Remember to always observe your surroundings and take action if required. If you wish to cancel the view, touch the cross on the top right corner of the screen. When reversing into a parking space, the parking aid system automatically activates. The front, rear and side sensors automatically activate and the button indicator illuminates to confirm that the system is active. If you have an accessory fitted to the rear of the vehicle, it is important to remember that the system indicates the distance between an object and the bumper, not the fitted accessory. The rear camera, mounted on the rear bumper, automatically displays a high-definition colour image from the rear of the vehicle. The rear camera image displays on the right side of the screen and the left side shows the parking aid's 360 degree overhead graphic. Touch the full screen icon to display in full screen view. To revert back to the split screen view, touch the full screen icon again. Reversing and parking guidance lines are overlaid onto the rear camera image. The solid line represents the projected wheel trajectory. The dotted line is the safe working width of the vehicle including the exterior mirrors. The short horizontal line is the luggage compartment access guidance line. Do not go back any further than this if you need to access the luggage compartment area. The coloured area indicates that the parking aid sensors have detected an object. A warning tone increases in frequency as you move closer to the object. The tone becomes constant when the object is within 30 centimetres of the bumper. Always observe the surrounding area and estimate the distance from the vehicle to the object. Take appropriate action if required. Touch the camera icon. The four cameras, one mounted in the front grille, one in the rear bumper and one on each of the exterior mirrors are used to display camera images on the touchscreen. A graphic of the vehicle is displayed in the centre of the screen. Touch the arrow icons to select the associated camera image. Up to two images can be displayed at the same time. Touch the 360 degree icon on the center of the vehicle graphic to display a bird's eye view. The parking aid system will remain active until you select park or drive forwards at a speed of more than 10 miles per hour. The indicator in the parking aid button extinguishes when the parking aid system is no longer active. For further information about this feature, or any other feature, please refer to your owner's handbook. For help or assistance, please contact your Jaguar Land Rover retailer, who will be more than happy to assist.